This is a recording from the fishing vessel Maria de los Angeles. And it's a recording from the Notus Trollmaster system. Uh, the Notus Trollmaster system is a wireless net monitoring system that places sensors on the doors and on the trawl and provides trawl geometry information wirelessly back to the fishing vessel. So this is an actual recording from the vessel. So as we see here, these are the parameters that the Notus Trawlmaster were measuring. The information is displayed in this sidebar and on the trawl itself. First, a short review on the information monitored. This is the starboard trawl wire length, then the port trawl wire length, the door spread, <coughs> the distance between the two doors, the headline height, that is the distance from the headline to the ocean floor, and we also provide headline distance or the distance from the vessel to the headline. And this is the depth of the door from the surface. And this is the starboard door heel. So the door was leaning inward at a 10.9 degree angle. Then we have the port door heel. That means the port door was leaning inwards at 4.7 degrees. Also monitored is the starboard alignment and port alignment. And this is the alignment behind the doors to the center of the headline. So if we can play through this file and we see that it, it has a very solid link between the vessel and the sensors. So they are keeping a spread of about 100 meters <coughs> and a headline height of 15.3 meters. Fishing at a depth of about 357 fathom. One very interesting thing about this vessel is they turn a lot throughout their tow. This vessel can make a 0.1 nautical mile turn in just 15 minutes using the Notus Trollmaster while still being at a depth of over 350 fathoms. Here is one su such example of the turn. So we see here a tremendous difference in the trawl wire lengths. One trawl wire length is at 1441, the other is at 1355. So there is a tremendous difference between the distances of the two doors from the vessel. We also see at this point in this turn that the trawl has actually come off bottom because the headline height has gone from 15 meters up to 43.4 meters. So therefore we know that the headline and the trawl are off, have come off bottom quite substantially. At this point we also see the difference in the, in the heels of the doors. So we see one door healing at 8.2 degrees, while the other door, the port door, is healing back at 4.9 degrees. We see here as well a difference in the trawl alignment. So we'll just play throughout the, uh, the actual turn. We can see the information changing quite drastically here. And we can see the vessel coming out of the turn. 
at this point we look at the data again and we see that the trawl is back on bottom because the headline height is now 14 meters the starboard distance is 1448 and the port distance is 1448 or another way to say it the starboard trawl wire length is 1448 meters and the port trawl wire length is 1448 meters again here we see the accuracy of the notice system in the trawl wire lengths the door spread is at 101 meters and the doors are both starting to heel again at an inward heel we see different views here this is the bird's eye view showing everything square again and some angles on the doors the alignment view here we have one trawl door and here we have the starboard trawl door therefore with both doors on this green line we we see that the trawl doors are in line and we also see here that both doors are healing inward just slightly <coughs> at about 8-10 degrees <coughs> so again a very strong link at uh, 1500 meters of trawl wire out between the trawl sensors and the vessel <coughs>